Hey, I'm Cameron McKenzie, Editor-in-Chief at TheServerSide.com, and I want to quickly show you how to create a branch from an existing git tag. And if you want a spoiler, it's this command here, git branch, branch name, tag. So I've cloned a git repository over here, and it's this git repository that I've cloned. And if I take a deep look at this repo, you'll notice that, well, there's one tag in it. It's the M1 tag, and that tag just happens to come on the, what is it, the second commit. Um, so you can see that over on GitHub, it's a little easier to dissertain when we come over to a git here locally. I can go git log dash dash one line and you can see that well I've got an M1 tag milestone one on commit F5E240E that one there that was the second commit so let's just imagine that I wanted to create a new branch off of that commit and I think that in that commit I've got two files Baker and Adam whereas in the current branch that I'm on which is the main branch at this commit I've got three files so let's say we wanted to create a branch off m1 when there was only two different files there how could we do it well it's just the git branched command you give it a branch name and I'll call it my branch and you provide the tag and that tag is m1 I click enter and it looks like it didn't do anything but if I do a git branch a you'll notice that hmm, my branch is there so my branch is created can we prove that my branch has been branched off this particular tag well I can do git branch a again and well we can see my branch that's not what I want to do I can do git branch git log dash dash one line that's what I wanted to do and you can see that my branch is here branched off of tag M1 which is F5E240. Furthermore if I switch to that branch git switch we don't use checkout anymore we use git switch and we switch to my branch we'll notice look up here Adam Baker Carroll when I come here notice we only have Adam and Baker and that's a manifestation of the fact that when that commit happened log one line again the only files that we had in this second commit was Adam and Baker and there you go that allows us to create a new branch off of an old tag in git now of course if I wanted to go back to the other branch I could just go git switch and go back to main and then we get all of our files and I can go git log one line again and you can see yeah in that third commit we added the carol file and that's why we have it there so there you go that's how you create a branch from a git commit now if you enjoyed that quick tutorial why don't you head over to the serverside.com i'm the editor-in-chief over there we've got lots of great tutorials on git gitlab github bitbucket devops tools and just enterprise software development in general if you want to follow my personal antics you can follow me on twitter at cameron mcnz and please subscribe on the youtube